Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. Who's here today? Well, we've got a deal and we've got precious. But don't just sit there, pickles. Come on, let's have some fun. Bring them over. Cowboy picture in. Do we going to make a cinema? Do you know what I love to do when I go to the cinema? I love to sit with a big box of popcorn and maybe me some too. juice. Last time my mum took me to the cinema and I sat down with a big box of popcorn and juice. And what else do we have yeah. here? Oh, this one's dark. <laughs> 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 well, we've got a deal and we've got precious. But someone's missing from home today. <laughs> oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Who's that? Lisa. Yes, it's Lisa. <laughs> With Raymond. Hello there. Raymond. Hiya, Granny Murray. <laughs> oh, and Lisa. Come on, we do, honey pie. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all this paper. I don't fancy clearing all that up. <laughs> <laughs> Will you listen to your dad, Lisa? I think he likes making a mess better than he likes tidying it up. <laughs> Wait till I show you. We'll be making a toy cinema. Yeah, look at this, Lisa. <gasps> Why don't you guys dress Claude up as a film star? Come on, then. <laughs> and we can be shooting stars and scoot over to the cheers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're having a special cinema day today. Oh, lucky you. You know, I wish I'd known. I've just been given a new popcorn making machine for the buffet car. I could have brought crunchy popcorn for everyone. Oh, what a pity. <laughs> Movies go with popcorn like jelly goes with ice cream. It's an old cine projector. Yes, it belonged to my husband, Angus. It doesn't really work anymore, but we have good fun with it. Do you know, this has given me a great idea. I'm going to give the Buffy car an old movie theme. That's the perfect way to advertise the new popcorn machine. Oh, that's a brilliant idea. <laughs> well, I'd better be off and you better start clearing up. <laughs> oh, yes. I'll turn it into a game. Cleaning up should be entertaining. Well, shall we? Oh! <laughs> oh. Heaven, I'm in heaven. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Raymond. Oh, will you look at Claude? Doesn't he look like a fabulous, glamorous film star? <laughs> Mind you, I'm not sure about this moustache. Yeah, I think you're right, Granny Murray. It looks more like something the old movie clown Charlie Chaplin would wear. <laughs> <laughs> That's better. <laughs> Lisa, I'll see you later, my wee star. Bye. <laughs> right, I better get off. I don't want to miss the Popcorn Express. <laughs> oh, no. Come on, my darling. <laughs> now remember, cleaning up should be entertaining. Thanks, Granny Murray. You guys have a fun day. We'll be thinking of you, darling. Me too. Now, will you keep a wee eye on Raymond? Make sure he gets the right way to work. I'm a bit late for work today. Can you tell me a quick way to get there? Thanks. I'm in, 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 in a hurry. I need, 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 need to speed to work. Take a take a ticket on the metro. I'll be 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 there quite quick. Hurry 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 on the train lines. Clatter 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 at the points. Whining 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 drives the speed up. Squeaking 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 slows us down. Clatter 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 through the streets now squeaking squeaking to our stop. I'm in 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 a hurry. I really really need to get to work. I'm in, 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 in a hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. OK, we're here. But before I can get down to some work, I have to change. So, busy, busy, busy. All dressed and ready to go. Ha-ha. <laughs> oh, 10 o'clock. Oh. And we're off, bang on time. Hello, Raymond. My man, Mickey John. Where are you heading off to today? Molly Moore for the teachers' conference. Well, can I interest you in today's special to help pass the journey? Sure, what is it? Listen. Hey, there's a whole lot of popping going on back there. Yep, 
Popping popcorn. It's a pound for a big carton. Ooh, go on. You talk me into it. Ah. Yeah. Great. Now all I need is a film to watch while I'm eating it. If you come back later on, you can watch the Biffy car. I'm giving it an old movie theme to help sell the popcorn. Old movies? Oh, I love them. You know, my favourite old movie stars? Laurel and Hardy. Laurel was always messing things up and scratching his head. And then Hardy would twiddle his tie and say, that's another nice mess you've gotten me into. <laughs> I'll pop back later and get some more pops and entertainment. Bye. <laughs> oh, you won't recognise the place. OK. Here is a picture of the old movie clown, Charlie Chaplin. And the finishing touch, oh, Lisa's toy moustache. <laughs> I wonder how Lisa's getting on at Granny Murray's. I love to skip in Rivers Evening. a funny walk. You, Molly, let's see it then. <laughs> we can do this one. <laughs> that is a funny walk, isn't it? <laughs> Lisa, that was so good. I think you're going to be an entertainer like Daddy when you grow up. <laughs> Hi, Raymond. Oh, nice picture. It looks a bit like Louis. <laughs> oh, without the moustache. It's the old movie clown, Charlie Chaplin. So, where are you heading to? Molly Moore. We're performing at the Mayor's Tea Dance. Ooh, sounds posh. It's all hoity-toity. <laughs> What's that noise? Oh, it's just my popcorn popping in my machine. Oh, would you like to buy some? Yes, please. It's a pound a carton. Coming up. So why have you got a picture of Charlie Chaplin? Well, I'm making an old movie theme to help sell the popcorn. Old movie music is brilliant, <laughs> especially the stuff they play when they're all running around chasing after each other. It's a pity we're getting off at Molly Moore. We could have played some movie tunes for you. I know. Why don't we lend you our hats? They're just like the one Charlie Chaplin's wearing in that picture. Good thinking, Chuck. <laughs> oh, well, don't you need them? Not today, it's all hats off for the mayor. <laughs> well, thank you very much. <laughs> I think we'd better be off. See you later, and thanks again for the hats. See ya! <laughs> and I'd better go on with my work. I love my train. I love to do chocolate, lemonade, or tea. I'm just very happy serving you. Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day, making special moments on my way. I'll tell a joke and toast some cheese on toast. Oh, I walk, walk, walk all day, bringing smiles and happiness my way. Being nice is what I love the most. So happy being me, meeting all the people on the train. Can I help and clear your things? If there is a problem, I'll explain. Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day, wheeling trolleys, weaving to the street. I'll do a trick and make the journey quick. Oh, I walk, walk, walk each way, loving all the things I do each day. Bringing smiles and happiness my way. I love my train. Oh, now that's the rush over. I can get back to the movie business. The movies come to the Buffy car. Scene one, take one. <laughs> now, you can't make a movie without a camera. So, ooh, this'll do. One here. And the other one, here. And we're rolling. <laughs> Give us a smile. The camera loves you, baby. <laughs> Ooh. 
Hello, Mr. Charlie Chaplin. I hope you're having a nice journey. <laughs> Might you know how Lisa's getting on? for much longer. De -de 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 it's a CD of music from silent movies. Oh. <laughs> Thanks very much. I'll stick it right on. Yeah. We'd better leave you to it. We don't want to miss our stop. <laughs> Ciao, Bella. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, this is your stuff. Now I'm starting to feel like I'm in a real old movie. <laughs> What's that noise? <laughs> It sounds like crunchy snow. Oh, it's popcorn. Oh, it's everywhere. How did this happen? Oh, I've worked hard all day to give the Boofy car an old movie theme, and now it looks like it's been snowing popcorn. How did I let it get into this nice mess? Where did the time go? At eight o'clock, I took Lisa to Granny Murray's. She was having a cinema day which gave me the idea of using an old movie theme to advertise my new popcorn maker. At nine o'clock, I arrived at work. At 10 o'clock, the train left, and Mickey John was the first to try my popcorn. He really liked it, but spilled it all over the place pretending to be Laurel and Hardy. <laughs> at 11 o'clock, Chuck and Louie arrived and lent me their hats. I sold them two cartons of popcorn, but most of it ended up on the floor. At two o'clock, the lunchtime rush was over. By then, I'd sold lots and lots of popcorn and was ready to start doing up the boofy car. At three o'clock, Louie and Chuck popped back to lend me a CD of old film music. It was then that I came out from behind the counter and I noticed that the boofy car was covered in crunchy popcorn. Now remember, clearing up should be entertaining. Remember, clearing up should be entertaining. So now I'm going to have to clear up this nice mess. I should make it entertaining. <laughs> it's a race against time. I've got to do it. I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it. I've got to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong. I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song. Do we think he's going to do it? Do the job that needs to be done? Will he know how to fix it? I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong. I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song. All done. <laughs> and just on time, too. Here comes Mickey John. Wow, what a transformation! I love it! As they say in the movies, <laughs> very clean and tidy too. But uh, I think I'm going to have to have another carton of popcorn before I'm able to enjoy it properly. Hang on. You aren't going to do any more Laurel and Hardy clowning while you eat it, are you? <laughs> no, this is my stop. I'm going to have to save this as a treat for Rebecca. Ooh, there you go. <laughs> Bye, or uh, adios, as they say in the cowboy movies. <laughs> Yeehaw! Adios, amigo! <laughs> Oh, I wonder if Lisa's had as much fun as I have today. I'm sure Granny Murray kept her entertained. <laughs> oh, what we 
Would your dad say if he could see you now, Lisa? I'm thinking of you, Daddy. Hello, Raven. Hiya, Granny Murray. Look who's here, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Have you had a good day with Granny Murray? Oh, we've well, had a fast day. <laughs> And are you going to say thank you to Granny Murray? Thank you, Oh, Granny come here, my darling. Oh, she's been the best girl, haven't you? And it's a big thank you to you for me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. Clearing up should be entertaining. <laughs> it saved the day. Well, I never did. Come on, you two. You'll want to be off home. Bye, my darling. I'm looking forward to next time. Me too. Come on, Lisa. Let's chat about our time alone. And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too? Well, there was waving, greeting, hello, meeting, bye bye, closing, quaking, dozing, eating, sleeping, fetching, sketching, painting, stretching, gluing, chewing, jumping up and turning round, dressing up and sitting down. <sighs> but what was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed as an old time movie star because that's what today was all about. We got off to a great start when Raymond and I danced around like a couple of movie stars. Bobby and I dressed up as Laurel and Hardy and put on a funny old movie show for the children. It was such a laugh. Meanwhile, Raymond created his own entertainment by pretending to be Charlie Chaplin. He had a great time clearing up all the spilt popcorn and made clearing up entertaining. And that's what I call a very entertaining day. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye-bye, honey pie. <laughs>